So I completely missed this last week due to the fact that I never look at the official Ashes of Creation forums. For some reason, I don't really know why, but over on the forum, someone asked in a thread about clarification on spot testing, stating that it was stated several months ago by Steven that spot testing would be starting within the next several months. We are now several months past this date and not a word has been said about this. Even though I have seen multiple questions for the monthly live streams about this, this leads me to believe that spot testing is currently already happening, probably under NDA, or it just won't happen at all given Alpha 2 is only six months off. My concerns are, if this has not started, will this be offered to everyone that purchased a $500 plus bundle to support the game, or will it be offered to streamers only, which is what I would guess is happening. I think that when this starts, everyone should have an equal chance at jumping into testing the game, whether you bought the bundle or not. A very good question, because if you remember way back in the October AMA, someone asked Steven when spot testing would start, and he stated, can we expect to get any pre-alpha spot tests this year or early next year? And would those be <coughs> on NDA from Lineker 180? Um, yes, we will be having spot tests. Um, well, we are, technically we're already doing spot tests internally. Um, we do that uh, <clears throat> right now. Uh, but we will be including spot tests with some of uh, individuals from the community um, as part of the next several months. Um, and the, those will likely be under NDA. Um, and that's because there are specific core systems that are part of Alpha 2 that we want to uh, test. These will be very short geared tests, likely uh, hours long, starting first with some portions of the community that are uh, present from Alpha 1 and for Alpha 2. Um, but when we have uh, dates uh, solidified for those tests, you will be receiving communication from our community team. So Vaknar headed over to reply to this post on the forums where he stated, I wanna provide some clarification and perhaps assist with some misconceptions. I can assure you that we are often testing the game internally. When it is time to bring in some extra help from outside the studio for spot tests, we will notify these people. It may be under NDA. There is priority for testers. For example, Phoenix Initiative and Alpha One testers will likely be among the first summon to these spot tests. There is no announced date for the release of Alpha 2, spot testing will not be offered only to streamers, and we are working hard on getting Alpha 2 ready to be played. We are eager to play Alpha 2 with all of those who have keys as soon as it's ready. So essentially, the big takeaway from this is, well, no one outside of Intrepid Studios is testing Ashes of Creation, and we probably aren't getting that spot testing Steven promised us in a few months, and we'll just be more of the ones that he said are happening at the end of this year. Intrepid is constantly testing it internally though, but they're not ready to put it into the hands of other testers, not even PI. And although Vagnar didn't comment on Steven's timeline, well, Steven probably said this because Steven likes to get ahead of himself at times and give dates before they are sure they can be met. He is very excited and passionate about his project and it happens kind of all the time. It sucks, but at least you know that you aren't being left out. But there is part of me that thinks that they were truly ramping up something big last year and had some major hiccups that slowed them down and that's why December's stream was pretty lackluster and these timelines with spot testing have been pushed back and even Cyclops which was originally supposed to be shown only two to three months after it was announced and part of that could have been the Unreal Engine 5.2 push that took them a lot longer than they thought or maybe they decided there was more they wanted to do before showing it off to the world after the negative reception they had in November with the Cleric Showcase. They even were teasing something big in December but then nothing big ever happened. But also there's that possibility that it is actually all in my head and a lot of us were looking way too much into things. I also was personally under the impression myself that PI was testing until I saw the Cyclops showcase last month. Just really out of pure assumption, I figured with that tier that they were playing something, even if it was minimal. And when all of the devs were out in the field and no testers, it really was kind of like a wake up call to me that Intrepid is not ready to show this to any testers, not PI, not Alpha One, not anyone. And when they are, we will probably hear about it. We do now know that Alpha Two testing will start ramping up at the end of this year though, if Intrepid manages to stick to those dates and heading into 2024, we will finally get our hands on the world of Vera in a content playable state that we have 
all been dreaming to test out. And then we just gotta wait for launch whenever that will happen after. If you made it this far into the video, then I assume that you are enjoying this content. So please do me a huge favor, help the channel out by clicking that subscribe button and hitting that thumbs up to support the growth as we head towards Alpha 2. Otherwise, if you're new to Ashes and you've yet to create an account, feel free to use my referral link in the description below where you can jump into the forums, buy some cosmetics, or just hang out until you can finally step foot into the world of Vera. Otherwise, be sure to stay tuned for a lot more to come.